Well, before I proceed much further on my Chinese knockoff, I need to get the ride height settled where I want it, at least on the body. And the problem I'm running into is this uh, battery tie down arm or strap or whatever you want to call it. Anyway, this piece of plastic right here, if you look at it, it's it lays kind of flat, meaning 90 degrees to the horizon this way, and then it takes a sharp turn up or not really sharp, but it turns up and my body is resting somewhere on this area. So I figured the easiest modification would be to make a new piece, run it straight across here and then go up, right? And that'll allow my body to sit down lower. So turn the vehicle around, you look at it something like this, and I, well, that looks kind of complicated. It's really not that complicated. If I take a scrap piece of plastic and I lay it up this way, Right? Why go to the outside and then switch to the inside? That way all you have to do is notch it for a battery tray. You can use it of aluminum. And I got a scrap piece of aluminum right here. I got a couple of different scrap pieces. I'll, I'll make a template first once I get a functioning piece and then make a finalized copy. Also, one particular note on this particular knockoff vehicle is, let me set this battery tray down as low as it'll go is this battery tray will actually determine that this is the amount of suspension travel that's set in its lowest position if I raise it up let's put it way up there you see that we get quite a bit more suspension travel so I mean depending on what you want to do what your goal is you may have to modify your body or battery tray mount Accordingly, I don't want my body to sit way up high in the air. I think for the most part flat and level Gets a decent amount of suspension travel Especially for this size vehicle. It is 112, but There's a little something extra for you guys who are looking to get a little maybe extra suspension travel out of a solid axle rear design where your battery basically hangs over the rear axle very easy modification with a little bit of time and effort and really doesn't cost you anything other than some scrap material. Have a good day.